The Audi Q6 e-tron is equipped with a completely new interior concept. It features our e-cubed architecture with an extremely high level of performance. It's providing a lot of power to the vehicle. It also allows us to connect a large number of components. One of our major highlights is the MMI curved panoramic display. This is an element that blends the two axes together. And then there's the PID, the front passenger display. This is a real premiere for Audi. The Q6 e-tron is the first vehicle where we're installing it. The new driver's side is very clean and reduced, but still allows the customer to personalize their experience and control their most important features directly on the driver's side. This is another of our highlights. The augmented reality head-up display allows us to blend the content of the navigation system with the environment. For example, if I have to turn left, I will see an arrow on the road in the AR HUD that shows me exactly where I need to turn. The CID is where the entire infotainment control takes place. The 14.5-inch display is the largest we've ever had at Audi. The basic idea behind its structure is that users can always operate the most important controls directly. We have excellent ergonomics here, as this curve display is oriented toward the driver, allowing them to control the content easily while driving. The display features the dashboard, which is divided into the media tile and the navigation. This can all be personalized, of course. And with just one swipe, I can access the three-tile view, which I can also adjust in detail to my individual preferences. I can go into my app grid here and see all the apps that are available in the vehicle. You can already see it here. There are not only Audi apps, we also have the possibility to install third-party apps. You can explore various apps in the App Store and then download them and use them here in the vehicle. Up here we also have the digital assistant that's always displayed. The assistant can process any voice command from the user and respond to it. But the assistant can also make suggestions proactively as it learns how the user behaves. Hey Audi. Hello. Drive me to Munich Airport. Munich Airport in Oberding. Would you like to start route guidance? Yes, please. Okay, I'll start route guidance. It's a completely new type of experience. I didn't have to take my eyes off the road and was able to operate this whole use case via voice commands. The purpose of the front passenger display is to entertain the front passenger during the journey. For example, it features various apps such as video apps via which the front passenger can watch videos during the drive. This is possible because we have a type of shutter technology here. This means that only the front passenger can see the video during the journey. The driver cannot see it so that they're not distracted from driving. This is a completely new form of interaction at Audi.